dude, I think we... So, that's legal. Uh, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, I have here the Pelican R40 rut case, watertight, crush proof, dust proof, and I'm bringing this along with me to my trip. Absolute beast of a case. I got it in orange, my favorite color, and I'm gonna show you guys just what I'm bringing and putting inside of this thing right here. So it comes with this little tray where you can put your cell phone or whatever that lifts it above the actual area of the case. And what I'm gonna do is put some things underneath some necessities, got my SD cards, I got USB connectors over here, my micro SD card adapter, I've got the USB-C, and I'm also going to be putting my power bank, my portable charger underneath. So on the flight, you know, it's a five and a half hour, five and a half hour flight to California, I'm going to place my phone on here and I actually can put a charger through this hole or one of these slots and charge my phone inside of it. And then I might actually be able to fit my hard drive inside of here too so it's pretty small it might fit right in this pocket right here and then that way I can put my laptop just in a separate bag and not have to worry about losing any of the accessories that I need for it so once you get everything in the case just close it up and you don't have to worry about anything getting damaged you guys are going on your flight I'm also going to be using this when I'm doing some fishing up there putting all my necessities in here my wallet my phone just to make sure that it doesn't get damaged or lost when I'm out there. Getting super long TSA line today. Flight leaves in like a little over an hour, so the boarding time is gonna be in like another half an hour or so. So hopefully we get inside those gates before then. Fun. Good one. Shane, high five. <laughs> All right, guys, so we are in California right now. Just flew in last night, watched the baseball game today. And tomorrow morning, I'm going fishing with Daniel from Philosophy D. I've got to wake up super early. It is 12 or 11.50, uh, 8.50 Hawaii time, and I've got to be up at like five o'clock, six o'clock, because we're meeting at the Santa Cruz Wharf to take some skiffs out and go fishing out on the ocean here in Northern California. It should be a lot of fun. Hopefully I'll wake up and get enough sleep so I don't um, drain out the rest of the day. So see you guys in the morning. Oh. It's to take the California one exit. Oh, these are some fat hooks too, huh? Yeah, seven knot hooks, and these are these are called shrimp flies. And basically, you're supposed to mimic like a little krill in the water. All you do is tip it with some squid or something like that. We have squid today, and uh, just drop it straight down. And once you hit the bottom couple cranks up so you're off the bottom and you could just leave it there or jig a little bit and if there's rockfish around man they're gonna they're gonna bite that the squid kind of gets its smell in the water yeah yeah for them they'll they'll take the fish sometimes you could catch a rockfish and then a lingcod if they see it they'll actually come up and grab that rockfish and sometimes they they're, they're not even hooked and so they're literally just biting on the fish and you pull them on the water really, while they're, while yeah, they're, they're holding just, it yeah they're what? just they won't let go. It's <laughs> crazy. So they're pretty if, if if they're in the area, they'll bite whatever you Hopefully, got down there. Yeah, if they, if they're, you know, they're hungry. Alright guys, so we are out here at the Santa Cruz wharf, the pier, and um about to go fishing. I got my Pelican R40 rut case. I emptied it out so I can put some of my things inside that I don't want to get wet. I got the rental car keys right here. Also gonna be putting my phone right on top. Just like that. Good to go. Yeah. <laughs> 
I was reading something that uh, you can't catch them anymore. Huh? Oh yeah, yeah. It's uh, they're in quarantine now. It's like during the warmer months, there's a uh, usually algae blooms. Uh huh. And, uh, and these mussels start accumulating toxins that those algae produce. So it's not safe to eat. Not safe to eat. Yeah. Well, hi guys. Justin here with Fish and Dive Hawaii with Daniel Philosophy D. You guys have seen our last collaboration, but. We're out here in Santa Cruz, the wharf, yeah, or the pier. Yeah. Taking these little skiffs out, gonna catch some rockfish, hopefully some ling cod, and see if there's any action way out there. Hopefully I don't get seasick. Co took a couple of Dremamine, but Daniel said these little boats are a little different, so hope, hope for the best of luck on there. There's a, the boardwalk right there. So these skiffs out here come with a net. Sick. I seen that. Stope. Yo, you just tie it straight blood knot to this. And that's it. Starting off with a big piece of right here, baby. Let's go. Use gloves, or you don't really need to. Huh? What's that? Gloves? No. Okay. I bought some cheap gloves. Oh shit, this is a big one. Might have to go out a little further. Does it feel like sand? Does it feel like sand? This is pretty much bottom fishing, huh? Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> oh, here we go. Yes. It was like it was like messing with it. Huh? It was messing with it. Yeah. It was playing with it first. I got a bite too. There's some fish down there right now. Yeah. <laughs> Stoked. I'm also getting bites too, dude. This is a spot right here. I'd have to go up to that spot again. Maybe. How's it feel? Feels alright? Yeah. Oh, that's a nice, that's a nice brown. Dude, I think we just passed by a school of browns or something. Woo! Ha ha ha! Alright, dude. First rock pick Awesome. Ever? Yeah. You just grabbing the gills? Uh, yeah, you could grab them by the mouth, it's fine. Oh, Those for real? guys don't have any teeth. Ah. Link on do though, so. There you go, man. Oh, shit. <laughs> Sick. Reese the beat. Over. First fish ever right here. This is kind of first uh, rock cod. I mean, it's a nice one. Sick. What is that? Is that like their tongue? It's a brown. Uh, no, this is their their bladder, dude. Their swim what? bladder. And so like it helps them uh, stay down there. But when you bring them up really fast, well, it comes yeah, out of there. Yeah, yeah. Wow, that's crazy. I would. Yeah. Is there size limits for these? Uh, those, no. Okay. Yeah, how big is that? That's like a 13. That's pretty good. Wow, That's dude. Like 13, 13, 13, 13. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. Is that your first one? Yeah. <laughs> Damn, I think we just passed by a school while I was getting bites too. This yeah. fish is beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, I caught my second thing of the day. A oh, shoot. I 
was expecting them to be like more sharp, like more, more spiny, I guess. What? These fish? Oh, dude. Like they get, oh, that'll is. get you up. Is it? Yeah. Oh, shit. So poke, I mean, it would be like a bee sting. You just buy that at any market or what? An Asian market. Huh? At an Asian market? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Something bites it. It's gonna be a link hog. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I think you're on. Huh? Come on. Yeah, come on. <clears throat> Fish of the day right here. Oh, it's fighting now. It's fighting now when it's getting on top. I hope he's not a small link hog. It's a blue. Small blue. Damn, I think that took my other bait too. Alright. First rockfish of the day, right here. Fish is sick. <laughs> so here, these, these are blues. They have this like, they have this pattern right here, and their their uh, their head is usually a little smaller. This was a little smaller than your brown rockfish. The mm -hmm. head, and then they have these patterns right here, like this. It's almost like a mask. That's yeah, what I think of. It's sick. So these are blue it's rockfish. Like spotted all along. Yeah, these are pretty. I would say. They, they come in schools, so they're probably a bunch down there right now. Yeah, my knife. Yeah, I should be on this thing. Sure. Those might be like a school down there, you said? They usually yeah, school they up? they come in schools. So I was a little... I was off the bottom, you know, because I wasn't at my pole, so I wanted to uh, get a couple reels off, off the bottom, so I don't try to snag up while I'm doing this. Yeah. One on a uh, whole jumbo squid before. Dude, that's crazy. I've never seen this. Jumbo squid? Um, I feel like they might sell that there, but I've never seen anybody use it. The whole thing is bait. Yeah. <clears throat> but they bite, they'll bite that for sure, Link Cod. Link Cod will bite the octopus. I don't know about a whole jumbo squid. But yeah. We'll see. Got a nice little experiment going. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a decent one. Yeah. That's what's up. That's another fish, baby. Oh, yeah, that looks like a hot bag. If you don't feel like you have a really big fish, let me know and I'll grab the net. Okay. This is like the same size. Oh, oh double up. All right, now that I know they're venomous. Nice, dude. These browns are really biting. Yeah. And do these ones school up too? Or oh, they pretty much all do, huh? Sick. These things are venomous? Yeah. What? It's fine. It's crazy. These look a little sharp too. What about their the fins on the side? Uh, what these? No, yeah, these are just the top they, is they venomous. Some, yeah, they have some spines right there. Spines right here. Oh, structure. I don't know. That was a steady pull. I don't know. That was a very slow and steady pull. Sometimes you're fishing light bait. They they'll like they'll take it, but they'll sort of swim with it. It's not like they snack it and then they swim. Oh with yeah, it. yeah. So they like inhale it and then they'll sort of swim with it. And so you'll just feel constant like it'll just feel heavy for a sec until you set the hook. Uh -huh. And then that's and then that's when you're really you know, you got, you just got a couple thumps. Oh, something I've been fishing on my live bait like right now. I'm gonna set the hook. Get it? Oh no, let go. Definitely something was on it though. Oh, there it is. We got it now. We got it now. Came back for it. Go on the net. Nah. Uh, yeah, grab the net just in case. Wow, must have been swimming up with it. There it is. There it is on the jumbo, oh. on the jumbo squid. It's a decent link hot. There we go. Oh, boy. Woo. All right. 
Alrighty, first link out of the day. Damn, these things are big. Yeah, I told you, man. Look, it swallowed it. Oh, that's oh, I got oh, and straight to the gill plate. Open my eye. Oh man, what's that? Oh yeah. Check this guy. Yeah. Alrighty. So that's legal. Uh, for sure. Definitely. <laughs> yeah, it's probably like a 20. Yeah, it's about 26 and a half or something. Almost oh, yeah. 27. 26 and a half. Yeah. That Sick, fish. man. I have to hold it up. It's <laughs> dope. A rock fish on, baby. Nothing, you know, nothing, nothing big, but something at least. Nothing. Damn. <laughs> this looks like a small vermilion. These are good eating fish, but this guy's a tiny guy. I'm gonna toss this guy back, like a goldfish. <laughs> Sick. That's a nice color. Vermilion. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh guy. Oh no! Don't take my fish. <laughs> Oh, don't tell me it's a small ink cod. No, it's a small <laughs> ink cod, dude. Oh, it's a nice color. Yeah, they got this blue color here. Well, I guess I could show it. Damn, the wild. Solid the wild's fish. fighting so hard. Alright, later, guy. Yeah, I didn't get it on for the bite, but... And they just hit like that. Ooh, that's a nice vermilion. Oh, that's a nice one, dude. <laughs> that's so funny. Dude. Is that good size for the, for these ones? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's a great size. Yeah, they fight like they fight. They fight harder, yeah, than the other ones. I feel uh, like maybe. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, this guy's you know decent size. It fought harder than the brown fish that I caught too. Yeah. This fish is sick. It's mm -hmm. nice. They look tasty too. Right? Yes. Guess they're all biting now. Oh man, I was trying to help help out Justin with this fish right here, and then I was, got a bite. <laughs> See what this guy is. Rockfish. I think is another vermilion. Yeah, I bet it is. Really? I don't know. That was really close together, the bites. Yeah, that was. Uh, we're about to move, but maybe not. Yeah. <laughs> this current is strong. It's been oh, yeah, you're right. It's not a vermilion, I don't think. Oh, oh is it? No, it's a, it's, a, it's a little copper. Dude. Uh, oh, on the Kai-Tac again, dude. <laughs> the Kai -tac's killing it. There's a nice fish on this one. On that swim bait again. Oh, there's a nice fish. <laughs> uh, I don't know, it might be a link cod. Came after it. It's a swim bait, though, so. Or it's a decent rock fish. It's not really fighting like link cod right now. So it might be a good good sized rock fish. I'm hoping so. Jeez. That line was far. <laughs> Drifted out. Yeah. Oh, it's a rockfish, oh, looks like. Is it? I don't know, it's fighting like a link cod now. Unless that's a massive rockfish. That's a good rockfish. Oh, oh no, it's dude. A ling. It is, huh? It's a ling. It's a ling bit on the bottom again. And, uh, on the tricep again. I think that's a keeper, yeah. Should be a keeper. Do you want him? Sure. Right. Yeah, I could gift that. Gift one to you. Really? Only oh, one per person. You can just take home one per person. Yeah, yeah, one per person. Another on the Kai Tech. Whew. Yeah, man, that black, that black cherry is doing work. That black cherry Kai Tech swim bait. Twenty three, right there. You see? Yep, on the bottom. Let's see. Yeah, You're good on this eight. side. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Right in. All right. There we go. Man, I gotta switch to those swim baits. <laughs> oh! Double? 
one or? Double. Double though. That's a decent brim. Nice roll. <laughs> That's a decent size one. Yeah. Here we go. Let's go. Yeah, these swim baits, right? Like, <laughs> like I'm saying, dude. This is like my second drop with them. Yeah, yeah. I hope, uh, you know, I could put Justin on some link cod. I don't know. How's that feel? Feels like a decent mm, rock fish? Yeah, decent. Cool. Probably like the same size as the ones I've been catching. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Yep, yep. That's, a, that's another. Oh, that's a copper. Oh. That's a copper. Oh, again, the black cherry, dude. They're just loving that today. <laughs> Cherry. All of them are biting those ones pretty much, yeah, huh? Yeah. Especially your other ones. Yeah. Oh, that's a solid one. That is a solid one, dude. Nice. Yeah, they've all been like averaging the same size. Yeah. The yeah. ones I've been catching. Yeah. All right, guys. So just filleted most of the rock cod right here. These are the fillets right here.